This video is a demonstration of how you can link the communication between roles and Unity. Mm. This was made possible using a uh, ROS bridge package uh, for ROS. This allowed ROS to communicate with other software, in this case Unity. Now, you can see here in this exercise, I have this environment with robots. You can see here the mobile robot, turtle bot. Uh, it's a quadruped robot, and uh, here the quadrupter. This environment is a city, it simulates the, the motion, the movement of the, of the mobile robot. The goal for this video is to move the robot using a ROS publisher. Now let's move on to to start this this simulation. First of all, I have to launch the communication to allow the communication between ROS and Unity. In this case, I have to launch this launcher this starts uh, the ROS bridge and starts at the same time the, the publisher now I wanna launch uh, this to to show you the the image of the Unity because Unity uh, published image to ROS of the of this environment. Now I have to add my image. This is the topic that Unity sent the image. No, start unit. Unit. Okay. So you can see here this the, is this the image that Unity sends to ROS uh, through ROS this package. This is the image uh, that you can see in, in ROS and this is Arbis this is a tool of, of ROS. So now I wanna send message from ROS to Unity. This is the publisher. Um, I'm, I'm going to send commands to move the robot using the keyboard. The keyboard. Now the robot is, is moving because uh, ROS sent commands to Unity and Unity move the robot in this environment. So writes the robot. This is, a, this is an example of you can make a, a video game using ROS and Unity for mobile for mobile for mobile application or for uh, for PC video game for for instance. 